crunch bait. Hey guys, welcome back to Dragon Tails Fishing. So today I've got a really cool video for you. So I went out the other day and I went fishing uh, just with myself and the day started out kind of like every other day and uh, then it got really cool. So I edited this video uh, because I needed to get the video kind of shortened down a little bit, but you got to check this out. I came across a school of not one, but like hundreds of snook. You got to check this out. So please watch the video till the end. And if you haven't, like and subscribe to my channel. Dragon Tails Fishing always has great videos for you. So let's get into it. Love you guys. Let's do it. We're going to start out because I'm editing the video. We're going to start it out through like this. Let's walk through the house. Puppy dog, we get back. Are recording. Not a big one, but we got one. Yeah. Oh, hold on, he was a big one. Nice one. Got him. Got another one. He's a good one. Gotta make sure he stays in. Oh. Oh, I caught him by the... He ain't a big one, but I still caught him. I caught him in the back. There are so many of them right here. Come on. Got him in there. Got him. In the back. Oh, yes, got another one. Got another one, boys. They're like, oh, did he get up? Nope, he's still there. Got him. Gotta make sure to get him in there. Yeah. Yes, sir. Come on, yes, sir. Oh, yeah. Snooptopia, baby. Nope, nope. Good size, look at this. A little bit bigger. No. Oh. oh yeah, he's a good size. So many snook right here, bro. I hear that I'm just gonna keep on casting. Like I don't even have time to change my line right now. <laughs> I don't know, hopefully no. They must have smelled my lunch. Yep, there's another one there. Got him. Got him. Nice. Come on. He's coming in, but he's trying, to, he's trying to get off. And my line was frayed a little bit, so I'm just hoping I don't lose him. Yep. Yep. <laughs> oh, he swallowed that one. He ain't getting it unless he breaks my line, which he could. He did. He broke my line. I knew it. I knew it. Damn. 
I'm gonna let this other snook go. Nice snook. Damn, time to retie. They're everywhere. And I'm making as much noise as I possibly can, huh? Mm, they're everywhere. Can I get another one? We're about to learn today. Still there. We're about to put this assassin on him, boy. Put that white one on him. Got him. First cast, dude, they're like everywhere. Cast after cast, baby. Yeah. Okay, got a little, got, oh. Oh, what the hell? That's what I get for her. I must have had a prey in my line. I just lost my freaking bait. They are everywhere. Y'all can see that. They are everywhere in here. I must have caught it too close, cut it too close up because I'm in a hurry. Got one. I got a little guy. Little fella. That's four snook right there, baby. Got him. Oh, that was a big one. He just snapped my line. Oof. Dang. So many snook, dude. I'm just gonna try my paddle tail real quick. Oh yeah, oh yeah. Oh, they, they want that. Like two thumps, all in that same spot. They were just waiting for the fish to come through that conveyor belt. Kind of slowed down a little bit. <laughs> Got him. Got another one. Oh, come on, let's not. Nice one.
keep that line up so he doesn't fray it. Oof. Ah! Oh. Damn! They are killing me. They are eating my line, bro. Look at this. They are absolutely attacking it. Mm. Lost. Probably four twitch baits and one paddle tail so far, you guys. These big ones are fucking annihilating. These snook are so hungry. Dude, I'm gonna try. Oh, there he goes. Got him. Bam! Snooky, snookies. Jumping everywhere. I just want to pull one of these big ones and they are so up, they are so active that they are fraying my line. I've got 25 pound leader on here. It's just not enough. Calm down for a few minutes. And then when those pods and a bait come through, they're just on it. Checking my leader. Got a few plays in it. Man, I'm gonna lose it again. Here. Got him. Ah. Oh. Nope. I got him. Oh. Oh. Come on. Not this time, buddy. He's a good size. I gotta get him in the boat. Get him in the boat, guys. Look at that. Mm. Yep, it's a, oh yeah, nice one. Beautiful snook. Mm -mm. Got him jumping in the boat, boys. Mm, he's in. Big in, boys. Woo! Woo! Where are my fish grips at? And he is hooked. That's what I'm talking about right there, boys. Now that's a snook. Oh, he tried. We almost got out of my hands that way. Damn! Put that right there. Put that right there. Let's see what we got. Oh, oh. oh I got a dunker. I got a dunker. Oh, I got a dunker. You got my bait, do you? Yes, sir. That right there, boys, is a nice... Nice fish, man. That right there is a nice fish, boys. He is 24 and a quarter. And I don't know if you can see that out there, but there's more out there. So let me go ahead and get my phone, get a nice little photo of this fish. And that's right. All right, boys. L24. Right there, boys, is an L24. Look at that. I'm not even trying to, well, I can fish the tail. Bam, 24. Beautiful, beautiful fish. I caught him on a green goblin paddle tail on that one. But there's more fish out here to get, and I'm about to get them. Let's get them, boys. Write it down just a little bit on these snooks, but I know they're still here. Back to my little switch bait. Hopefully I can get a little light on this. So, 
all the blow ups have kind of died down. I just saw one last one, so I'm gonna keep trying it just a little bit longer and then we're gonna move. If I don't get anything here in the next few casts. I'm using one of my favorite patterns right now, so hopefully I don't lose this one. I love this pattern. Call it the zombie pattern right there. I really like that pattern. So hopefully I catch me a fish on it and don't lose it. A little uh, disconcerting. I've lost four quick baits already. All from catching fish and then cutting my leader. 30 pound leader. There we go. Look at that. See, I knew they were still there, bro. I knew it. Look at that. Look at that. Let's get in there. Yes, sir. There's a big one, too. I seen him jump. Oh, there he is. There he is. Got him. Told you. Oh, no, no, you don't. Oh. Nice, look. Nice. Oh yeah, he's gonna probably bust me off as soon as he runs. Oh, my fish bait, baby. Don't lose him. Oh. I just gotta let him run a little bit. No, 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 not the bushes, not the bushes. Just trying to go in the bushes and break me off. That's probably what he's gonna do. I'm gonna sit right there until he tires out a little bit. Maybe move some poles around. I don't know if we're gonna be able to get him, guys. What do you think? Think I'll be able to get him out of here? This will be our last dish right here. Oof. This is going to be hard. This is going to be hard. I don't want to do this, but if I get my boat turned around, that's going to be money. Got him. Get him out of here. Woo! Getting him out of the bushes, boys. He ain't going nowhere. I mean, I hope. <laughs> yes, sir. Nice. Nice fish. You're not the cleanest catch. Maybe not the cleanest catch. Ah, got him. Right there, boys. Nice snook. He's not as big as that one, but I, I guarantee you he's big enough for me to say yes, sir. Right, we gotta get these. And I caught him on a zombie, but look, I think that happened when he went in the bushes, so he was almost about to let, let it go. Cause he was giving me a good fight. And it definitely wasn't st stuck in his head. <clears throat> oh, I got him good. <laughs> there you go. Just stay right here for a second. There you go. Right there on my twitch bait. Couldn't even get my lunch. There was so many snook here, bro. 
This is crazy. I love it. I love it. Look at that. Beautiful. I would say probably around 22. Maybe. We're gonna find out. We're gonna find out. You're gonna learn today. Can we get a more a mark on this bad boy? Let's find out. Got him. Yeah, he's definitely not as big as the other one. Looks like I got him at about 22, maybe. Uh, yep, 22. That boy right there is some good table fare. Look at that. Beautiful. Beautiful. Mm, mm, mm. That's a 22 inch snook right there, boys. Man, that was awesome. So I ended up having to go in the bushes to get this guy out because he was trying to break me off inside of the, underneath those uh, tree branches there. But no, 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 not today, Satan. Not today. My Twitch baits, man, I'm telling you, they love them. Love them because they mimic the actual bait that they're going after. So when they see it and it's a different color or a different pattern than what they see, it differentiates from the other bait. Bro, your money. Let's do it some more. Let's go. So yeah, we're gonna push back a little bit further. Um, what I want to do is there's a couple spots that I always fish, and I, I have a good chance of catching something there. I'm hoping to catch a redfish because I've caught a lot of a lot of snook today. Um, yeah, at one point I had two uh, fish on the boat and didn't even have time to like get the pictures with them or nothing, man. I was just kept throwing, throwing, and throwing, and those snook were eating my bait a lot. They were taking my line. Dude. They took four of my twitch baits, man. Four twitch baits. They took one paddle tail. Yeah, it was just insane. Love it. We're gonna keep trying to go back here. Ah, a little rain shower while we're out here. It ain't gonna be too bad. Just one little doo doo cloud above us. No uh, thunder, no lightning. Just a cool saw. <laughs> yeah, buddy. So if you haven't yet, check out my uh, channel. Uh, I know a lot of you guys watch me and uh, enjoy the content. I know you can too. So give me a like and subscribe down below. Uh, we'll be doing a lot more videos. And yeah, look at that. Little boys. And then the puppy dog. Old puppy dog getting wet, poor kid. We're just cruising on back. There's a couple more spots I want to hit. Hopefully I catch something. Uh, looking for a redfish now because man, I was just hooking up this snook by snook by snook. Well, we're gonna start heading back. Uh, we're almost out of the uh, marsh here. We're gonna hit one more little spot right off here to the left. And then, uh, yeah, we're gonna call it a day. Man, that was awesome, dude. I lost out how many snook I hooked up into in that little spot. Yeah, I got a little plane up there, but uh, yeah, I seen them tailing. I seen their backs out of the water in a few spots, and I just couldn't get them to commit, or I wasn't set up or angled right uh, to, to get them. Uh, just so you guys know what I was using, I'm just gonna give you a little show off. I uh, used a bull bay rod. I uh, got my my Florida fishing products. This is the uh, Osprey, I believe, or the, yeah, this is the Osprey 2500. I uh, use the Skinny Water Lures paddle tails, and I'm also using their hard baits. Today was all done on this one right here, which is the Green Goblin. I'm using a 316 thought. My other rod was a um, Florida fishing products, but it's the Bahia uh, 2500 as well. That's my favorite size. And then I also have, check this out, I'm gonna show you. Right there is a Shimano Stratic. Uh, it's also a 2500. Uh, great rod. I got it also on a Bull Bay rod right there with this the Assault rod right there. I don't know if you can see that. It's a, eight to, it's a seven foot, eight to 17 pound, medium heavy fast rod. 
nice rod. I use this for my heavier lures. Right there is just a Uzuri. I didn't catch anything on the Uzuri today. So that's the equipment I was using to fish with. The kayak that I'm on today is the Blue Sky Boatworks. It's a Angler 360. Uh, it has the pedal drive, but my pedal drive is messed up. So I went all motor today. Uh, my last trip out, I actually ran out of juice because I was towing a buddy uh, who doesn't have a pedal drive. He actually has a paddle kayak. And I ran out literally right in the same area right here where I had to pedal back. And then I noticed that the pedal drive was having an issue. So this time I went out, but I also brought an extra battery just in case, but I didn't need it. I've been going all day long uh, back here in the flats uh, and I have not ran out of juice yet. And I still got plenty of power left in the, uh, in the box, I think. But if I did need it, I'd have, I'd have enough power. So just check this boat out real quick. This right here is the Blue Sky Boat Works. I've got a Newport Vessels Kayak Series. 55 pound thrust. That right there is their Newport box that's just kind of got all the power hookups to it. Inside is a Dakota Lithium 60 amp hour battery. I also have another battery box right there, which is holding 100 amp hour, but it's one of the Amazon style. And uh, yeah, this is the boat, man. I got two power poles on the back, but one of my power poles. Uh, the battery died halfway through the day and that's because I didn't charge them up at the same time. So uh, when you go out, <laughs> make sure you charge all your batteries because otherwise you might be out one or going without. So yeah, there you go. And look at me, I'm just standing up on this thing. It's an amazing kayak, man. Uh, I'm going to push myself back out into the intercoastal. We're going to ride back. I'm going to get off on the ramp and I'm going to go have me some lunch. I haven't eaten all day drinking sodas all day i don't know if that's good for you nah i don't think so but i want to thank everybody for watching and if you want to enjoy the rest of the video where i'm just kind of going back to the dock i'll try to record it just so you see us going through the intercoastal on the blue sky boat works and uh yeah thank you for watching guys and uh i'll see you guys on the next video mm -hmm. let's go ahead and turn this knob see what you got there we go. Oh yeah. Put her away. As you can see how fast we're moving. We're probably doing an easy five miles an hour. I know that wind is gonna make some noise, but I'll just put some music to this as of right now. Hey folks. Harley, you about to get wet, buddy. Come on, we're gonna get wet. Look at them waves, dude. <laughs> yeah, let's slow down just a hair. Sorry, Harley. You're gonna feel it. Maybe not. Keep going high gear again. So I'm going to leave a little link down below as well. Uh, if you guys want to check out Skinny Water Lures product, I'll also, uh, like I said, I'll put a uh, link in the bio somewhere and you can click on it. If you want to, you know, help sponsor us as a lure company, uh, check them out, man. Great baits. I hand uh, airbrush every one of these uh, hard baits that I have. Um, all the soft plastics made by my partner. Uh, we make jig heads. Uh, we make hard baits, soft baits. Uh, check us out, man.
you all there you guys. I appreciate everybody watching. Until the next video, I appreciate every one of you guys. Like and subscribe to the channel. Love you. Daddy Tales Fishing Channel.